right, so the maintenance just ended for JP and the new Christmas event has started and not gonna lie, I'm a little bit disappointed. The free servant being Katsukotl, you know, I could I could get behind that. I could get behind that. Uh, as for the new Lancer chick, Bradamante, who's, you know, yielded a lot of memes because of her noble phantasm. Um, and, uh, you know, I like her design, so uh, let's just leave it at that. I know people are gonna point out the glaring uh, a fact that in her NP she, she shows a little bit of her, you know, behind if you will which I'm sure I'm going to utilize for my thumbnail because I know that's what people want to see in the end of the day but the main reason why I want her is because she is an AoE Lancer which I don't have in uh, an AoE uh, 5 star Lancer I should say which I don't have in this account again I run multiple accounts or I should say two JP accounts one NA account and uh, yeah I'm not going to wail for her especially in this account this is my non-wailing JP account where I just uh do the paid gotchas and that's it. So yeah, I only have Skatat and Enkidu who I haven't trained in this account, ironically enough. Um, I haven't trained John fully yet. No, I haven't trained a lot of these servants. This is not my main-ish account where I focus on uh, on training servants, but I do roll here every now and then just, just you know, for the videos and just because it's, it's, it's fun. Oh, wow, I thought Ketsukoro was gonna be here. Be here. I guess Ketsukoro is gonna be here on a later date because I know she's gonna have a rate up as well. I thought they were going to have it together in day one. But I guess not. We're going to have Summer Martha who is back for this event. Which I think this is only the second time um, where we had a non-paid gotcha slash non-summer event gotcha with a summer servant in it. I think the other one was the, I forget which million downloads, but it had uh, Tomo Lancer in it and Kiyohime Lancer and all the other summer servants that came with her. Um, so this is the second time doing it. So this kind of opens the doors for future um or I should say past summer servants coming back in future non-summer gotcha slash non-million downloads gotcha. So that's nice. So I want to know, guys, what's your opinion on Bradamante? Because um, I like her design. I like her design. And I know what you guys might be thinking. Oh, it's because it's because of her ass, right? It's because of what she shows in NP. That's not necessarily true. I When I saw her, I was like, oh, the design, you know, I, I like it. I like it. Uh, that was prior before I saw the NP. And even then, uh, after seeing the NP, I liked it. Not because of the reasons you guys might think. I like it because it's a quick NP, which we don't see a lot of, and generally they're bad, but hey, why not? It is an AoE quick, quick NP that could stun, so it's like an AoE um, Skatat NP, basically. That's kind of what it is. Um, and she also gives NP damage up to herself, which means her overcharge might actually do something, which is good. And yeah, I, I'm, I'm a fan. I'm a fan of uh, more quick servants, uh, more uh, five star quick servants pouring in. I am kind of disappointed though. Because I wanted Kotomi Nikide to come out for Christmas. But obviously that didn't happen. So I'm going to skip out on this gotcha for my other account. As for this account, um, I need, again, I need an AoE Lancer 5 star. So that's going to be nice. That's going to be nice a lot. And yeah, and I think I have St. Martha um, Summer NP3 already. So if I get two more of her, I'll be able to NP5 her, which is always good. So... Yeah, um, so let me know, guys, what you guys think about Bradamante and her NP and everything else about her. Um, a lot of people are actually kind of annoyed from what I saw, annoyed of her design and a little bit annoyed by her NP, which I could kind of understand. I'm not um, a fan service type of guy either. I am more of a fan of just the general design of the character, not necessarily the, the boobs or the ass or anything like that. But um, aside from the point, I'm still going to try for her, so... Hopefully my luck hasn't ran out because uh, for the past uh, couple of videos, my luck has been uh, pretty god tier. So hopefully it continues. So let's start off with the usual five singles, usually from the tickets. But sometimes we use quartz for the singles. But we have 37 tickets, so we're not going to be using uh, quartz for the singles for a, bit, a while. And um, hopefully we get her pretty early on because I do want to save. Again, these are save quartz. This is not my non-whaling account. Um, if you're wondering why I use uh, two JP accounts, uh, don't ask why, I'm just a psychopath like that. So that was the loading screen, so we are gonna get a new crap distance. There you go, we start out with the, uh, I just realized, is Eric Bloodax, is he streaming or is he reporting? Cause it says live right there, he has a headset. Is he is he rolling in a gotcha too? Is this, is this a meta, is this a meta artwork where I am currently recording this as he's streaming? Okay, anyway. Yeah, okay, so there's our first uh, event uh, event shit. So, and sh uh, by the way, Bradamante is not limited. 
if you guys didn't realize that already she's not limited so um if you guys fail to get her which will be i'll, I'll feel bad for you but um there's always a chance um that she's gonna spook you which honestly I, i'm not a big fan of the five star spooks my damn self but if you want bradamante and you don't get her let's hope one day she spooks you so i believe this is the fourth single shot so it is another loading screen use which which generally means which generally means uh, is this is this for real am i okay it's a writer so it's obviously martha all right you know what i'm not mad Martha did get a, a normal Martha, 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 <laughs> Martha did get a reanimation, which, you know, a lot of people are really happy about. So I'm, I'm happy about it, too. So I'm not, I'm not mad. I'm not mad. Although don't come to me too much because I think I already have you like MP4 already. So maybe just one more and then never come back to me ever again. And then I'll be quite happy. So there you go. We did get we did get Martha. We did get a gold servant already. So that, that's pretty sick, nasty, if I do say so myself. All right, we, we got this shit craft essence, whatever. All right, so, Tenor of the Gods. My past couple of videos have been godlike, so I don't want to, I don't want to, I don't want to come off as arrogant or anything, but hopefully the luck still continues, guys, and we're going to be able to do some sick, nasty shit. Also, I'm really hoping, I'm really hoping that she doesn't need any of the new items to ascend. Obviously, she might need it for her skills, but... As for Ascension, I kind of just want to send her right away and get it over with. Because I didn't start the new Lost Belt with this account yet. So I don't. I have zero of the new um, uh, items. So if she needs it for her Ascension, it's really going to bother me. And it, there's another gold. Okay. Is this, is this the power? Okay, Martha. I assume. Cool. Okay, now you're NP4. That's cool. I, yeah, I, I'm okay with you. I'm okay with you. Uh, so we got both Marthas um pretty early on so give me one more of each and maybe one uh bradamante is that how you pronounce her name by the way I, i'm not sure if that's how you pronounce her name but give us one of each and then we'll be sweet and sexy like hell so this is our second copy of this craft essence by the way hopefully we get at least one copy of everything from this gotcha and there's our, our other gold i was gonna say our guaranteed gold but we already got a gold servant so I don't know which one was the guaranteed one out of the two, but whatever. Another servant. All right, all right. I'm 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 actually kind of hyped. I'm actually kind of hyped. So yeah. So yeah. Um, also, if you guys are wondering if I'm gonna be streaming more Babylonia, for those of you guys who um, keep up with my FGO and NA videos uh, with JP or. Uh, I don't know why you're watching this video. Okay, anyway, um, if you're wondering if I'm going to stream more Babylonia, yes, I am. Uh, school's technically ending tomorrow, so I'm going to be able to stream as early as the day after tomorrow. I'm not going to say um, tomorrow precisely, but definitely within the next couple of days, I'll be able to stream more Babylonia. So by Friday, I would say by Friday, because I still have one more class technically, but that class is kind of chill. It's just a video editing class, nothing too crazy. I don't have to study too much. So hopefully I'll be streaming on either Thursday or Friday, one of the two. At the very least, Saturday. So keep your eye out on for that. I still need to finish Babylonia, so I need to hurry up. Because everyone's finishing it. Everyone's being like, oh, this was a good story. Everyone's posting like screenshots and shit. And I'm just like, I feel left out. All right, so uh, not a bad 10 roll all in all. Because I did get end up getting one of the gold servants. So we ended up getting St. Martha and then St. Martha Ruler. Now we just need... Bradamante, and then we'll be kind of set for this gotcha. We'll be kind of done with this gotcha. So let's go ahead and do another five singles and then another 10 year old. All right, all right, cool, cool. Obviously, not the most broken roles in the universe. If it was broken, I would have got St. Martha and Bradamante at the same 10 roll, but um, still decent. We didn't get any of the four star craft essences or the five star craft essence, I should say, any of the gold craft essences. And which is uh, kind of sad. We did get two of the three-star ones, so that that's something to, to note. Um, hopefully, we could just end at least with one of each of everything in this gotcha. I don't want to get any more uh, any more uh, Marthas after the fifth one, which should be one more for each of them. So I'm welcoming at least one more, but after that, Martha, you better chill. You better chill your ass out. Better chill your ass out. I like you, but I don't like you. 
enough to get a million copies of you, which is virtually useless unless I burn you into a rare prism. But we don't want to do that, right, Martha? You don't want to be burned into a rare prism. You want to be conserved. You want to be perfect. You want to be NP5, and that's it. No more. NP6, that does not exist. And I hope they never implement it because a lot of people will be pissed because nobody really has extra keeps extra copies unless you really like the character. Like, if I got an extra copy of Gilgamesh, I'd probably keep it, but that's just me. Okay, so those five singles were kind of garbage, so let's go one more 10 shot. One more 10 shot. Let's do this. Come on. Another loading screen. Let's do this. Let's do this. Let's get some of the craft essences. Come on. Come on, game. Come on. All right, all right. So we're starting off with the shittiest craft essence in the game. That's not necessarily true. I'm not sure if it is, but I'm just saying that for effect. All right, so the four-star craft essence. Actually, this is a pretty good CE, if I do say so myself. I think it does crit damage up, NP damage up, and NP gain up. So pretty good, pretty good for four-star craft essence especially. So really good. This craft essence, however, I'm tired of seeing it. I don't give a fuck what character is in it and what kind of uh, assets she's showing. I, I'm not a fan of that craft essence. This one, however, only for this event. I'm, I'm okay with this craft essence for this event. But after this, um, it's just going to be rotting in the second archive until the rerun. Um, Saber, okay. God damn it, Julius Caesar. If we see a gold lancer and it's like Karna or Enkidu or something, I'm going to be kind of like, why, why, why you do this? Or, or freaking Vlad, my arch nemesis. If it's Vlad, dude. I'm never going to play the game again. I'm going to quit. <laughs> no, I'm not. But uh, I will be quite perturbed. I will be quite perturbed. So unfortunately, so far, it looks like the only thing worth of note was that one event for Starcraft Essence and everything else in this turn was kind of, kind of looking like doo-doo butter so far. It's kind of looking like doo-doo butter so far. Arc for me. Okay, no. You could ain't. God damn it. God damn it. Is there another copy of him, really? Because it, it was really fast, so that means it's... It's another copy of him. Okay. All right, game. I see I see how it is. You're going to give me... You're going to give me a bunch of three-star Lancers, but you're not going to give me the, the five-star Lancer and the gotcha. I, 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 got, I got you. I got you, fam. I got you. Oh, okay. The five-star C. There you go. The one with Anastasia wearing her... Um, I was going to say Russian outfit. I don't mean to be racist, but um, what is she, Romanian? I, I feel like I'm embarrassing myself, but yeah, so she's wearing her little winter, let's just say winter outfit. She's wearing her winter outfit. She has her, her doll V with the, like um, deer horns on it. I didn't even notice that, so pretty cool CE. And yeah, okay, we got the event CE. So we got everything so far in this event, or in this gotcha, I should say, but the five-star servant. So can we do that? I want to say I have confidence with the amount of quartz and tickets I have, but, you know, you can never be too sure. It doesn't matter how many um, quartz or how many tickets you have. Uh, sometimes the game likes to fuck you in the ass and say, nope, we're not going to give you jack shit. So, um, not that the game hasn't given me nothing. Uh, it has gave me both Marthas, so I can't exactly say that. Oh, no. Calling it, calling it. I, I was I was getting excited just just a little bit just getting a little bit excited you know just just a little bit not 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 too much but I got you I got you Romulus I I understand I I see you bro I see you I see you bro Martha again Okay so I think you're NP five now so we don't we don't want to see any more of you um, if I'm just gonna be honest we don't want, unless unless it's your uh your ruler form then. Very well then, but after that, stop it, stop it, I, I, no more. If I get a Jack Spook, that would be nice too, because she would be NP4, one more closer to NP5, and that would be pretty sweet if I do say so myself. Pretty, pretty sweet. Pretty sweet. Oh God. All right. Oh, come on, come on. <laughs> It is a loading screen again, but um, earlier we just got Romulus, so we can't really trust these uh, 10 shots and these loading screens, you know what I mean? 
God, these Lancers. I'm getting every Lancer in the game. Watch me get every, like, gold Lancer, too. That's, you know, of course, not limited or not story locked. Um, and that, that that's going to suck. That's going to suck ass if I get multiple gold Lancers. I'm, I hope I'm not jinxing myself, but I really, really just want to just get her right away and just, just stop. I feel like I've been spoiled because recently that's been going on a lot. So I feel like I've been spoiled. So the game is trying to humble me and be like, no, bro, we're going to have you spend everything and you're not going to get the five star Lancer, bro. So I understand. I understand, too. My luck has been kind of kind of stupid lately for both NA and JP. I understand game, but come on, man, come on. God, Dominique, please, I want you to be in the game. One of these days, you have to be in the game, cause you're my you're my boy, dude. You're my boy. Okay, another Anastasia, cool. The Anastasia. I know how much you like me, Anastasia. So, um, if you could sprinkle some of your uh, magical snow dust of of luck and. And sexiness, I would appreciate it. So, uh, I, I I'm not saying you should spook me, but you should uh, tell Bradamante to come to your boy, and uh, MP5. There you go. All right, so she's MP5. So we got two of each Martha, which you know, it is what it is. It is what it is. Now, what is this? I want to say this is a good 10 roll, but with this Martha, she's already MP5. So this one's kind of just standing there. Okay. I see you, game. I see you. I see you, game. All right. So what's this? What's this, huh? Okay. You're going to give us this garbage. Please, no more Marthas. Please, for the love of God. Um, no pun intended with the god thing. You know, I, before this video started, I was planning on doing a lot of puns pertaining to ass and butts and cheeks, but I totally forgot to do that. Now, I'm, I think it's too late to do that. I'm, I'm not going to do it. I'm not going to be an asshole to you guys. <laughs> Get it? No, I'll stop. I'll stop. Maybe if we make ass jokes, maybe she'll come, right? Maybe that's that's the that's the way to bring her. So, um, let me think of an ass joke. Uh... I can't think of one. <laughs> God. I'm really tired, if you couldn't tell. That's why I'm acting kind of delirious. So. I'm super tired because it is still final finals week. I do have two big tests tomorrow. So I should really be allocating my time to studying. But hey, new gotcha's out. Has a servant that I'm kind of interested in. Why not? Why not do a video? God damn. Three star lancers won't stop. They won't stop it with with the with the coming with the coming. God damn it! Just give us the the Batamante and we'll be out of here quicker than shit. Is shit? If I say if I make shit jokes, is that considered an ass pun or a butt pun or an ass joke or a butt joke? I, I'm not sure because you know people have butt fetishes, but they don't necessarily have shit fetishes i know some people do you know not, not trying to judge but I'm, I'm just saying i'm just saying so can i make a shit joke and would it be considered a an ass joke let me know that in the comments because i'm not i'm not quite sure i'm not quite sure speaking of her ass though um her np i'll be honest i'm not the biggest fan of the animation and again if you have a butt fetish that's totally you but i kind of wish it showed her face first like a close-up of her face, like what they do with Achilles and all these other new servants that come out. And then it, the camera kind of rotates around her and then to her ass and then she flies off. That that would, that would have been a lot cooler in my opinion, but it just kind of just shows her ass right away. And then like, yeah, here, here's her ass. So, so I don't know. I don't know. And, and they, they're kind of lazy with it too because at the end of her NP, it just kind of looks like a glorified Excalibur beam. Like if you look at the animation for Excalibur, um, and then look at the animation for Brown Monte's NP, especially towards the end, it's pretty much the same thing. So it's like, oh, okay, I, I see you, DW. I see you. I haven't been paying attention to these roles. I probably should. I think this is my third one of this. So, you know, two more. Let me broken. Sick, nasty, fam. 
Sick nasty, if I do say so myself. Okay, we're obviously not going to get anything for this 10 shot. Okay, this was, as far as rarity goes, this is a very bad 10 shot. I mean, this to see kind of makes up for it, but I mean, come on now. Okay, we're running out of resources. I think we're like halfway through, and that's not, that's not good. That's not good. Because I wasn't planning on using everything, but I guess, again, I guess I got a bit too arrogant with my past couple bros, so the game is just trying to humble me, which you know what? I, I will fully accept because we're not getting out uh, empty handed. We did get uh, both Martha's MP5, so. Good, good, good stuff. Good stuff. I, I, I'm not, I'm not too mad about that. Not, not too mad at the slightest. Um, another loading screen. That's probably not gonna garner me, garner me shit. But that, that's okay. That's okay. A servant. There you go. So is it a random ass lancer, right? No, it's it's a writer. Watch it be Katakoto. No, I think she's like story, story gotcha servant. So no, it's Alexander. All right, Alexander. All right, fam. All right, fam. <clears throat> Bryce. Come on, just just give it to us. Just give it to us. Again, I, maybe I need to, like... I was gonna say seduce her, but... I'm not exactly the hottest guy in the planet, so... I don't know if she'd be into me. Is there, is there something in my room that resembles ass? I mean, I got the Jack the Ripper figure right here, and some people like looking at her ass, and that's kind of weird, but hey, that, there's that. Um, yeah, I got no catalyst. I, I don't know. I don't know what to say. I don't know what to say. Um, if you don't come, I'll I'll beat your ass, and if you do come, I'll I'll still beat it, but in a different way. I I don't know. I don't know what to say. I don't know how to how to get her to come to me, and then. And all that stuff. Yeah? I'll let you sit on me. If you come to me, I'll let you sit on me. And maybe that's what you're into. Maybe you like sitting on people. If, if you are. Apparently she's a pervert. So, um, at least historically, uh, that's what people are saying. So, uh, maybe, maybe she'd want to sit on me. Why not? I mean, I'm not into that again. But, hey, if you want to do it, um, more power to you. I will allow you to do it at, le at least once. I'm not sure if we're gonna make it a regular thing, but at least once we can make it. We can make it a once in a lifetime thing where you could sit on me, and if you want, I, c I could. You could sit on my head. You could sit on my face. Um, I I, I hope it smells okay down there. <laughs> this is weird. I I don't I don't know. <laughs> this is very weird. So if you just. I guess she's gonna sit on me now. Okay, so. All right, cool. So, sh that that's that worked. I'm 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 gonna have to let her sit on me now. All right. So the next time you guys are gonna see me, I'm gonna have this butt um this butt imprint on my face. At least for the next couple of videos, you're gonna see a butt imprint on my face. And it's going to be interesting. So, okay then. Thank you very much for coming to me. So, I, I like it. I like it a lot. Ooh, thank you. Anastasia, you too. I, I, I kind of like you, I guess. I, I really don't, yeah, I don't really have, yeah. Okay, let's just let's let her talk. I guess, I guess we're going to let her sit on me. That's right. Mm -hmm. You know, I saw a bunch of posts saying that she is part of the Charlemagne uh, Knights, so there you go. Uh, I, was, I was scared that all the Charlemagne Knights would end up just being traps, but she's obviously an exception to that, so there you go. There you go. Ha <laughs> ha, yes. Ooh, what is this skill? Oh, we're going to have fun with you. Hell yeah. So what does your 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 sprite look like? I I'm a big fan of her shield, but um Yeah. <laughs> oh her lance is really tiny and is that I was gonna I'm not gonna make that joke. Yeah y'all could
yeah, there's probably gonna be some weird fan art with that and and that in her ass. Just just saying, just saying. Okay, so we got her. Um, I don't know if I want to go for a second one for her. That might be in another video potentially, but. Right now, I think I'm satisfied. I think I got three of the Anastasia C's. I don't think we we're able to limit break any of them with maybe the exception of the three star craft essence. But hey, we got NP5 Martha, NP5 other Martha, <laughs> and an extra one as well. And then we got Bradamante. Now we got to let her sit on my face. So she, yeah, I, I guess it's going to happen. It's going to happen, guys. So let me know, guys, um, if you guys have ever had a female or a man, wh however you guys roll. If you guys ever had somebody sit on your face, let me know any tips, any tricks that you guys have to make the situation or make the experience a bit more pleasurable, a bit more pleasant. Um, maybe it's not as bad as I'm initially thinking. Maybe it's actually the best experience in the universe. But it's the prospect of having somebody's ass, regardless if you're a female, male, hot, not, um, it's just, I don't know. But yeah, I uh, hope you guys enjoyed this video. Like the video if you liked it dislike it if you disliked it comment down below let me know what you think about these roles and of course let me know what is your opinion on bradamante and whether or not were you able to get her as well and all that jazz and of course let me know just what do you think about this uh event in general with quetzalcoatl being the new uh, uh i was gonna say summer servant the new christmas servant and all that stuff so yeah and of course um it should go without saying if you're not subscribed I don't know why I keep doing that. Why do I keep doing that? Um, subscribe to become a supporting character to me, the main character, because of that. You guys, I'd be the only character, and that is no fun. So, I'll see you guys in the next one. And again, I will have a butt imprint on my face. If it's not there, then either it healed very fast, or she's not that heavy and didn't really add any pressure to my... Okay, I'll just stop. I'll just stop.